been all over the news. Catastrophic flooding, the worst since Sandy to impact the United States. And while the flooding may be hundreds of miles away, a group effort is being made here to help. We are blessed with a very responsive faith community here at the Diocese of Covington. The people always respond to needs, and we are sure that this response, August 27th, 28th, and September 10th and 11th, will be a very strong one. The first collection being called for is a material one and set for next weekend. Personal supplies like soap, toothpaste, shampoo, and deodorant, as well as cleaning supplies like detergent, cleaner, bleach, buckets, and rubber gloves are needed. However, some of the most important donations are needed for the little ones. Probably the most important thing are, are the, the baby goods because um, uh, those get uh, used pretty quickly. Um, everyone that I've contacted from the parish level to St. Vincent de Paul to Matthew 25 Ministries have been very responsive and, and willing to assist us in making this, uh, this assistance happen for the people of Louisiana. The supplies are expected to be on their way by early September. All the donations eventually collected next weekend will be brought here to St. Vincent de Paul, where Matthew 25 Ministries will take them the rest of the journey down to Louisiana. Reporting from Crescent Springs, Kentucky, Eric Zarnitz, WLWT News 5. And if you'd like to donate, please contact the Diocese of Covington. We have their number on WLWT.com. Volunteers are also still needed to help bring the material donations from parishes down to St. Vincent de Paul on Monday, August 29th. And donations for the flood victims in Louisiana will be collected today at the St. John's Dry Ridge Festival. Teasdale Fenton Carpet Cleaning is teaming up with Matthew 25 Ministries for the collection. Now they're looking for water, baby wipes, and bleach. You can drop off donations during the festival today from noon until 7.